this program is. Obviously, you're here, you're enrolled in it, you've got some sort of an idea, um, but this program uh, is going to work on the following objectives. We're going to work on nasal breathing, so we want your child to favor um, nasal breathing as the predominant method for respiration. Um, I'm going to teach your child how to recognize the spot. So we're going to work on proprioception there. You're going to learn all about correct tongue posture, correct mouth posture, and then um, we're going to work to re-educate the oral facial muscles. We're going to work to improve strength and coordination as well. Um, so let's talk about what this program isn't you guys i've said this over and over it is not meant to replace traditional myofunctional therapy it is not meant to um, be that end-all be-all therapy for your child and it is not meant to prepare your child for a phrenectomy child has a tongue tie um depending on the severity of your child's tongue tie they may struggle with some things in this program they're definitely going to benefit uh, in some way from this program unless they have total ankyloglossia. You know, if they're really tied all the way to the tip, they're really going to struggle. Um, remember, I always teach that a phrenectomy should be corrected when the child is at, of an appropriate age to comprehend, comply, and cooperate with therapy. Um, if you have questions about that, you are certainly welcome to schedule an exam with me and we can dive in a little bit further, but I'm definitely not going to get into that chocolate lick. Now, I don't have chocolate here. I wish I did. Um, but it says to spread a chocolate spread or frosting or something similar. I have people use Nutella, pudding, um, peanut butter, nut butters, just whatever you want, um, on and around the lips. And then first use the tongue and repeat movements to lick it off the upper lip, then the lower lip, then the left, and lastly the right. This exercise is working on the functional control and re-education of the anterior part of the tongue. So now notice it's not saying that chocolate lick is to just go in circles. That's not what we're doing. Um, it says, you know, the upper lip, then the lower, then the left and right. You don't necessarily have to go in that order, um, but the whole point is, is I don't want it to be correct by happenstance, okay? I don't want them to get all the chocolate licked off just because the tongue flops around, okay? So, and, and you don't, if you're working just on the upper lip and that's all your kiddo can embrace today, then don't put the chocolate out everywhere else, okay? So I would just put it here and have them do their best at that. I teach two minutes, or I assign uh, two minutes twice a day, and it says use your long lizard tongue you're going to pretend to put lipstick on. You will be using the tip of the tongue to slowly trace around the lips. Be sure to be slow and controlled. You're gonna catch that here, you guys, that I'm always saying, do it slow, do it slow. Um, put your lipstick on in one direction and then switch and go the opposite direction. So this is what it would look like for me. So we'll start up here. Okay, and so um, the intercom is called Waggle, Waggle, Waggle Spot. Okay, uh, and so it says in this exercise, you're going to use your pointy sword tongue. So remember, we've learned that we're not moving a pickle or a, a pancake sideways. We're going to be moving the, the pointy sword tongue to move side to side, tapping the corners of the mouth. This is the waggle part, and then you will touch the spot. Um, you want this exercise to be slow and controlled, okay? So first, open the mouth big like a big donut, okay? The cheeks gently pulled back, again, so we can take them out of the picture, and then raise the tongue up off the teeth until it is just floating in the middle of the mouth. Think the donut hole area, okay? So I always say, if this is the donut, we want it to be right here, kind of in the middle. Um, then, as if to cut that donut in half, gently wag the tongue to one corner of the mouth, then the other, then back to the other, and then up to the spot. So waggle, waggle, waggle spot, okay? Mm -hmm.